Winterberg, Germany for race seven of the BMW IBSF two-man bobsleigh World Cup. Rostislav Gajtukovic on another strong weekend after claiming his first ever two-man win in race one in Segulda a week earlier. Back on German soil in Winterberg, he was battling to hold off Brad Hall, who'd been just behind him in the first heat. Took the lead with four sleds remaining. Was there another podium beckoning for the Russian? In the final four sleds were three Germans. Christoph Hafer, a bronze medalist earlier in the season with Matthias Sommer behind him, slipped back behind Gajtukovic at the start and never fully recovered. Didn't have enough speed at the bottom to hold off the flying Russian. In the top three for the first time in two man on this track, Justin Cripps with Cam Stones both celebrated their birthday in the week between Sigulda and Winterberg and they gave themselves a late birthday present as Cripps guaranteed himself his first ever two-man medal in Winterberg. The Canadian had laid more than a quarter of a second off the battle for top honours. However, that was going to be fought out between two Germans. Hansi Lochner broke the six-year-old track record with his first heat to lead Cripps by 26 hundreds and built on that in the second. Another good drive, putting the pressure on the race leader. Lochner was guaranteed at least a silver medal, but would he take gold? The only man to beat Francesco Friedrich last season, could he do it again? Well, Friedrich made an even better start and tidied up the bottom of the track that had caused him problems to race away, tying his track record from the first heat and guaranteeing himself his 100th World Cup medal, his 42nd in two-man and his fifth win here in Winterberg. He continues to lead the point standings from Gajtukovic and Cripps.